seven blade version is putting out the power, way less stress on the engine, way more torque on the blades, enough to where the rollers I put together for it to keep it from going through the hub, literally chewing itself up and spitting itself out, still running. I put four of these in uh, across from each other, obviously, in X pattern. And it's to keep that fan from pulling through the bottom of the hub. And that means that this was putting out significantly more thrust because, one, we didn't have 22 blades. 22 blades is going to be for a cruiser, I'm guessing. But we're still running on 48 volts. We still haven't even hit 18 cells yet. So we're st we still haven't even hit 75 volts. This thing's chewing itself up, spitting it out, and it's still going. I'm telling you, I love this thing. It's it's just working like a dream. It could tear a bearing apart, spit it out the bottom, and the motor will still keep going. <laughs> and we will we we'll only hit half the RPMs. Half that this motor is capable of. So I cannot wait to put this on an application. This is actually going to work out really, really well. And it looks really freaking cool. It's working perfect, and it kept the motor nice and cool. It kept it nice and cool. So I think we got ourselves a another viable fan option. Lighter for the drone, less stress on the motors. I like it. I like it a lot. And I know you do too. <laughs>